Today I want to show you how to get your illustrated vector files into OpenGL in MaxMSP. First off, make a new document in Illustrator. It needs to be pretty big, otherwise Blender won't import it. Well, it imports it, but it's really small, so make this as big as you can. Alright, draw anything you want like a beautiful star or a hexagon thingy all right let's get that some color just for illustrator all right make it a bit bigger and for the heck of it there so pretty. All right. Um, next up is to export this vector file. My uh, Illustrator is in Dutch right now, but it should say export right around here. Name it whatever. Oh wait, 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 wait. One step back. Okay. Export it. I'm going too fast. Export it as an SVG. Scalable vector graphic? Yeah, I think it's a graphic. All right. All right. Uh, these settings, I played around with it a bit. I didn't see any difference. Anyway, it's um, this step is to get the scalable vector graphic into Blender so that it recognizes the drawing you just made. All right, let's go to Blender. If you need to blender, don't worry. Um, this is just this is just only to import the SVG and to export it as a OBG so that Max can read it. Okay. First, we're going to delete delete this cube. Uh, press X and hit delete. Delete it. Delete the little light camera. You can you can just delete everything. Okay. Import. SVG scalable vector graphics. Oh, that's multiple graphics. All right. So go to the folder you saved it. Whatever. Bam. And here it is. Okay. You can select it with your right mouse button. Then you hit Control Alt Shift C to set the origin to the center of the mass. And then press Alt G to get it right in the center. Press R, X 90 degrees, rotate over X 90 degrees, and we're finished. So export it as an OBG file. Cool. Now we can go to Max. Um, earlier I made a template. This is my OpenGL starter with grid template. I use it all the time because I can fly around with my keyboard and mouse. Cool. So let's get a grid.gl.model in there. Read the OBG file we just made. Whatever. Bam! And there we have it. Our own scalable vector graphic.